welcome to my easy statistics in this session we will be discussing about Cronbach alpha reliability test using PSPP PSPP is a open source software which we are going to use for Cronbach alpha reliability tests for discussing about Cronbach alpha reliability test I am using an example the example is about uh, eco-friendly products the researcher want to know two unobserved variables intention and attitude of respondents towards eco-friendly products to know intention he has used six variables and these six variables are called as observed variables and to know the unobserved variable attitude four variables which are called observed variables are used why we call intention as unobserved or latent variable is we don't ask directly the respondent what is your intention but we ask six questions like this like the first question i am familiar about eco-friendly product and we are asking the respondent uh, in a liquid scale to rate uh, his question so there are six questions which the respondent answers and of, out of the six questions from the six questions we will know the intention of the respondent in the same way about the four questions we ask to know about the attitude intention is an observed variable latent variable attitude is also an observed variable latent variable or it is also called as latent variable. now Cronbach alpha is used to know or to measure how well a set variables measure a single one dimensional latent aspect of individuals I'm saying to know intention the research is asking six variables questions but how these are related to each other how they are correlated to each other that is being measured with reliability tests and when we are doing this reliability test and we are using a uh, scale the scale should be uniform for all the variables in that group in this case the six variables are in Likert scale but if any one variable is not Likert scale then we should not include that variable in measuring the latent variable now we'll go for the software this is PSPP software I have total 10 questions are there in this question 1 2 3 4 5 6 are related to intention so first I will take the six variables to see how they are uh, correlated and um, how what is the reliability Cronbach alpha reliability the procedure is in PSPP I go for analysis in this we go for reliability now I am going to include only those variables which I want to check the reliability I have selected six variables and transferred from left side to right and alpha is I have taken model as alpha and simply say ok in the output window I got reliability Cronbach alpha reliability 0 0.86 the reliability is good because Cronbach alpha ranges between minus infinity to 1 but we need to only consider the values between 0 to 1 and the values which are more than 0 0.7 are considered to have good reliability which are less than 0 
are not having good correlation between the variables right so these variables which i am saying um, 1 to 6 are having a Cronbach alpha reliability 0 0.86 to measure the intention let me check with the next one that is all the four variables reliability i am doing the same procedure i go for analysis reliability now I'm taking the remaining four variables question number seven eight nine and ten I want to check the reliability about this four right I say okay in the output window for this four variables the Cronbach alpha is 0 0.69 it is not seven so the four questions are showing reliability of 0 0.69 in the sense they're not having uh, reliability to measure attitude so what is next i can do is i need to check if any one of this variable is removed or deleted is my reliability going to increase to do this i go for the same again analysis reliability and I have four questions to be considered right and my question is the four variables are not showing required reliability of 0 0.7 so I'm going to do deletion and know which question if I delete my reliability will increase I'm saying okay right in the output window in the output window you can see the reliability is 0 0.69 and if I delete question number 7 my reliability will become 0 0.75 yes so if I remove the variable 7 then automatically my Cronbach alpha will be 0 0.75 but if I remove question number 8 9 or 10 my reliability will decrease still so what I understand is Cronbach alpha item deletion if I delete question number 7 then my reliability is going to become 0 0.75 let me do it analysis reliability now I'm not going to consider question number 7 but I consider the remaining two okay now let me check it up yeah my reliability has now increased to 0 